YouTube, my name is Azir Games and welcome back to this brand new video where I'm going to show you how to download Mental Ray because all of you might have noticed Mental Ray is not in Autodesk Maya 2016 anymore. Uh, they have. Um, they didn't add it to the installer and so it isn't in the software, but no, there's no need to fear. And also, if you look in the plugin manager, you won't find Mental Ray down here. You just won't see. It. You just won't find it. So there's no need to fear because Jose is here, and I'm going to teach you how to download a uh, Mental Ray for Autodesk Maya 2016. It's actually very easy. All the links will be in the description. And so first of all, let's go to the page where we can download Autodesk Maya 2016. Just, uh, this is for Linux, uh, this is for Windows, and this is for Mac OS X, or I'm not sure, no, OS X, and um, uh, because I have Windows, I'm going to install the Windows version, so it's the middle one, just click it, it'll download, it'll take a couple of seconds, and when it's done, let's head over to the folder where I've downloaded it. So we're in the folder where I've downloaded it and let's just double click this, run. I haven't actually installed it myself yet, but I'm going to do all of this for you and it's very easy to install. Even no can do it with this tutorial. So right now what I'm doing is I'm selecting a folder where I want to install it because I don't want to have it on my C drive. But you guys can install it uh, on a default location if you have like only one hard drive or SSD drive where you install all of your stuff on, so I'm going to my folder and go to third party software and make a new folder called, uh, uh, what's it called again, um, I forgot, oh Mental Ray, Mental Ray, I'm making a tutorial on this, so click OK and it'll automatically select the folder where you want to save it, click OK and it's installing. So when this is done, or now it's installing, <laughs> uh, let's see, let's go back to the same folder again, D drive for me, software, um, third party software, and mental array, let's see if this will work, next, install, okay, and it's installing. This will take a little while or, while or not, but this is for the people out there who don't know how to install uh, Mental Ray for Autodesk Maya 2016. When it's done installing, click done. And then you'll probably have to refresh the plugin list if it's possible. Refresh. And then you'll see uh, it's somewhere around here. I don't know the name actually, but it might also be in this list. Um, where is it? Mental Ray. Uh, I'll be right back when I figured it out. <laughs> okay, and I figured out the problem. Um, yeah, it was the most bottom one. So the name is Maya To uh, Maya Tomer dot M M M L L. So just click load it and also click auto load for the next time when you start Autodesk Maya. And what I prefer after doing this is restarting Autodesk Maya in case, um, uh, yeah, in case you uh, crash the software because then you'll have to re-enable it again. And what you can do now is go over here and you'll see Mental Ray down here. So click Mental Ray, and I have to restart my Maya right now as I see. So let's do that really quickly. So right now Mental Ray should work, so let's go over here, Mental Ray, and then let's see, it looks different than the last time I used it. Okay, then create a physical sun and sky to make a test render, and then let's get the render over. Okay, and here you see it's uh, Mental Ray. So let's also make a quick setup over here. Um, just go really quickly. And then in the queue. Just go also a little bit. And then let's 
re-render it and see what we get. So as you can see Mental Ray is fully working right now so I hope this was a, hel uh, a helpful tutorial and also nothing but I hope you've enjoyed it, I hope I helped you and hope to see you guys back in the next video. Bye!